Tracy says, Tracy McGelfresh here. I'm in my studio today. I just have a minute before our lunch and I wanted to show you one of my current projects because I thought it was super cool. So another maker made a needlepoint design when she was in college and she needs somebody to make a pillow out of it. Now this thing was seriously warped because of the motif right here. It curled it up all around the edges and then she brought me for the back of the pillow and the piping stretchy velvet which is not going to work but I had a solution to the problem I took both pieces and I interfaced the back of them with a hot iron infusible interfacing I put the iron down in the middle and pushed all of the wrinkles out and then I surged around each outside now if you don't have a serger you can base stitch but you are going to want to put this side on top of the machine and feed it through because if you don't you are going to have all of this being pushed around you want the stable thick side on the top of the machine and then this to pull through the feed dogs same with the stretchy bits that's how it looks so nice and flat and there's no puckers if you start to have puckers this is because you've got this piece on top and the science of the machine you have a foot pushing and you have feed dogs pulling so you have pushing and pulling two opposite reactions going on that means there's going to have to be a change and the change is going to be that there's puckers so you want the stabilized piece on top of your machine with the foot pushing and the feed dogs pulling through so that's it tracy mcgelfresh tracy sews have a great day thanks bye